guys, so today I'm going to do a video. This is a contest entry. Um, first off, I wanted to thank you for doing the contest, and I really hope I win. I'm going to do a voiceover for a makeup look that I came up with. Um, I've already done this eye, but I will show you how to do the face and this eye. Thank you guys so much for watching. So I'm taking my Revlon Photo Ready Foundation, and I'm going to apply it with the sponge that it comes with to all over my face. Um, just to cover up all my blemishes. It gives me a pretty good coverage. Foundation takes me a while to apply. You want to make sure that you get your chin area and around your jawline so you don't get a, a foundation mark. Next I'm taking e.l.f. concealer in the color ivory and I'm applying it to under my eyes and my blemishes. And I'm just going to blend them in with my fingers. Next I'm taking e.l.f. pressed powder in the color porcelain and I'm going to apply it with, I can't get the plastic feeling out, I'm going to apply it with the e.l.f. powder brush from the studio line, they're both $3. This is just going to help set your foundation. Again, make sure you get the jawline and the neck. Next, I'm going to take Too Faced Shadow Insurance um, and prime my lid with this just to make sure that my shadow stays on all day long. Next, I'm taking NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the color Milk. It's just a white um, like base. I like to use it as a base because it pops and brings the color out of my shadow. And I'm going to rub it in with my eye, or my finger, <laughs> rub it in with my eye. Then I'm taking my Coastal Sense 28 Nutri Color Palette. Um, these are the colors that it comes with, and then at the top you see that I have a paper. That's just the names for the MAC dupe. So then I'm taking Cream Royal, or which is a dupe for Cream Royal, which is that color right there. You guys can see that I have a big dent in it. So it's a dupe for MAC Cream Royal. I think I've said that already. I can't remember. And I'm just going to apply, apply that, sorry for the setter, apply that to my entire lid and go just a little bit up above the crease. Next I'm going to take a blending eye brush and take the color right there that's a dupe for Max Sable, or Sable, Sable, like a horse Sable, I don't know. And I'm going to apply that to the crease. And I'm just using windshield wiper movement. Next I'm going to take just a sponge applicator and take the cream royal again. And I'm going to put that in my inner corner to brighten up my eyes. And then I'm going to put it underneath my lower la uh, lash line. Next, I'm just taking a shadow or a, um, eyeshadow brush and just a like whitish vanillaish color. I think it's actually like a dupe for Max Vanilla. And I'm just applying it to my underneath my brow bone. Next I'm taking NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil on the color French fries and just applying that as a liner on my waterline because I don't like to use like dark black just because I feel like it makes me look it doesn't look good on me. And then I'm taking Roma London, just professional eyebrow um, pencil, and it's in the color hazel, and I'm just filling on my um, brow. And 
And then I'm taking the brush on the other side and just brushing it over. Next I'm taking e.l.f. mascara primer, which is a white translucent um, mascara to prime my lashes. And then I love this um, mascara. It's covered our lash black lash glass lock fire. I'm talking really fast. And it's a black, but there's shimmer in it. So I just said shimmer. There's like a little um either silver or like blue shimmer in it and it looks really good. And then I'm gonna curl my lashes. You're supposed to curl your lashes before you apply mascara, but mine don't curl as well. And then I'm taking Physicians Formula Happy Booster Natural um, Blush and just applying it to my cheekbones or my cheeks and blending up towards my temples. I'm using a kabuki brush. I feel like if I use a kabuki brush, I can work with it more. So I'm smiling, applying to my cheeks and blending upwards. Next I'm taking e.l.f. High Definition Powder. It's just a translucent powder that goes on white, but when you blend it in, it just, what this does is it um, covers all of my fine lines, and it makes, um, it makes me not get oily throughout the day. And I get, I have really oily skin. And then I'm just going to blend it out with my kabuki brush. Next, I'm taking Great Lash just gel um, for your la uh, for your eyebrows because it takes a while to dry, so I don't want to put it on before I put my other powders on. And it just helps keep your brows in place all day long. Next I'm taking an EOS lip balm in the color Summer Fruit and just applying it to moisturize my lips. And then I'm taking NYX Pumpkin Pie. And I am just putting it on my lips. I think this is a really, really good fall color. And then I'm going to take this e.l.f. Hyper Shine Lip Gloss in the color Bubblegum, and I'm just going to apply that to my lips to give it a splash of color. These moisturize my lips really well, and they're only a dollar. You can get them from eyeslipstace.com. Like my dances. <laughs> and then I just like to spray this on while I'm doing the makeup. It's just um, Victoria's Secret Dream Angels Heavenly. Bye. This is the final look. I really hope you guys like it. It's kind of like a fall tutorial. Um, it's just like very neutral eyes. And then it's neutral lips. And then there's a splash of pink on the cheeks just to add a little bit of color to it. Um, I know it's not high br high end brands, but I don't really have any high end brands. But it's alright with me. It, it works the same. I really would like to try out some MAC products products though. Um, thank you guys for watching. If you guys like the tutorial, try it out. Thank you. Bye.